When treating a two millimeter lesion, every pixel of what I'm treating matters. At the PMC Lawson Cancer Center, our TrueBeam Linear Accelerator allows even the smallest areas to be precisely targeted. Our purpose is saving lives. Pikeville Medical Center has recently been awarded a grant from SAMHSA that will allow them to host weekly EMT training courses. The evening courses are being conducted by the Pikeville Fire Department and will accommodate any who need flexible hours to participate. Anyone can join the program free of charge. We got a grant through our uh, hard work of our grant department. We obtained a grant that has allowed us to buy some much needed medical equipment for our community responders, as well as staff and teach a EMT class to 36 successful candidates over the course of the year uh, that will allow us more people in our community that have the tools and now the knowledge in order to be able to provide care to their family, their friends, their neighbors until EMS can arrive. PMC is seeking to relieve the shortage of emergency workers in Eastern Kentucky. The program also advertises the wide variety of work available to those who obtain their EMT license. Our grant is for 36. Uh, we're almost there with this first class, so you know anybody that's interested in it, you need to be reaching out to Mitch Case at Pipewell Fire Department and getting him your information so that he can be putting you on the roster so that we can see how many we're going to have. And, and yeah, we, we structured the class. You know, It's two nights a week. I think they're running Mondays and Thursdays, if I'm not mistaken. You can work in doctor's offices. Uh, yes, you, you can be on, on the road in, in emergency medical services, which is, is a great thing you know, to know that you got to somebody in Phillips got them packaged, loaded, and provided the care that they needed that sustained them till you could get them to our emergency department. It, you know, it's a very rewarding field. You know, uh, the mines, the mines use what they call METs, which is a lot of along the same line. So somebody could have the EMT training and go into the mines if, if they so chose. So there's just, there's so many opportunities in, in the medical field for these positions. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.